I'm Janessa. And I'm Brad. And we're the creators of the blog and YouTube channel, Almost Heaven Homesteading, where we strive to live a wholesome, self-sufficient, and handcrafted life. I actually grew up in Michigan on a 40-acre farm. In the summertime, I was always helping my dad make hay. Um, eventually, my brothers and I, we wanted to get into 4-H. Um, and when we got into 4-H, one of the things I wanted to do was raise a cow to show. Well, raising the cow to show didn't really work out, but I still got the experience of raising a cow and tracking the expenses. And eventually we got into where we bottle fed them from one to two days old. And we had several at a time and it was just a very rewarding experience that I want to continue in my own home someday. Yeah, and I was raised in West Virginia. I was born here, I've lived here my whole life. And I was also blessed with a simple country life. Um, I grew up, I, I didn't grow up on 40 acres. We actually lived on four acres, but it was surrounded by wood, so it felt like a whole lot more. Um, and we spent our summers raising gardens. I always grew up with chickens. Um, and it always seemed like the center of our home was the kitchen. My mom was always in there making meals and we were always just working together as a family, doing something quite often in the kitchen. I loved how it felt like it just centered around the kitchen. It, it made for a cozy home. And that, that coziness and traditional lifestyle is something I definitely wanna continue with my family as well someday. So we met in July of 2021 and we were married in July of 2022. I think pretty much right away, we noticed all the similarities that we had. And after a few months uh, of dating, we began talking about how eventually we want to start a homestead someday. So we've been married for six months now, and we've spent those first six months in a small apartment. But our journey to that life is starting because we are actually going to be moving in a couple months to a really small garage apartment on 30 acres of land that we purchased. It's a slow process and our original deadline was to move at the end of February of this year. Uh, but like all building projects, uh, it seemed to not always go as planned and uh, it's looking more like uh, the end of March that uh, hopefully we'll be moving and uh, starting our homestead on the 30 acres. Yeah, so we plan to live in the small apartment for several years while we are preparing to build our home, but we're definitely still taking those steps to that self-sufficient life right now. We'll be starting our gardens and our orchards here soon and in the coming months and years to ultimately reach that end goal of being self-sufficient. We want you to come on this journey with us so that wherever you are right now, you can also take those steps to start living a wholesome, self-sufficient, and handcrafted life.